Welcome back to my channel, Life is Lakeisha, and we're back for another video. So, today I'll be doing um, what's in my diaper bag, what's in my baby's bag video. So, if that's something you would like, stay tuned. Okay, guys, and gents. So, this is thumbnail. This is my um, daughter's diaper bag. I got it from Walmart. This is actually her fourth, third, fourth bag she done had since she's been born and she's gonna be 14 months. So here we go. It's a backpack style. So we're just gonna be going through it and seeing what's in it. And if you stay to the end of the video, I will give you an update to one, where I been, two, what's going on, and three, will I be posting any more videos? So let's get into it. So in the side pocket right here, I don't have nothing in there. In the other side pocket, I don't have nothing in there. Or do I? No, piece of paper. Okay, in the front zipper right here, I have nothing, nothing at all. She's 14, well she's gonna be 14 months on the 27th of February, so. She really don't need much other than food, diapers, wipes, and clothes. And wherever she goes, she already had toys. So um, it's pretty different from like a newborn bag. But in this zipper, she have butt cream, desitin, and then I got her some cough medicine to us. It seemed like every month, every other month, she started coughing and sick, and no, she did not have the corona. She actually already had the corona, and I'm doing a video on that soon. That's some um, Zerdebees uh, cough syrup from Lucas. Um, some baby oil gel. If you hear screaming in the back, it's Delilah. I locked my door, I locked her out. She's outside with her uh, big brother and big sister. She's not like way outside, she's like outside my room. But some baby oil gel because she do have two more teeth at the top coming in. And then just a syringe thingy for her medicine. So I usually keep all that type of stuff um, in the big, the second big zipper. And she usually have Tylenol in there because, um, well I took the Tylenol out when she had got her shots. The shop's giving it to her. Now, for the big zipper. And excuse my background, I'm sitting in my room. Uh, my last sit down video of uh, why I quit my job video. If you haven't seen that, click out of this video and go watch that video and then come back. But, anyways, um, I like this better. It's just a plain wall. You know, in my other video, I was sitting in front of my living room door. So, in this big zipper, I love this bag, y'all. And this big zipper, um, I have her some snacks. Uh, soft baked grain bar, strawberry banana, y'all. When I tell you, Delilah love these. She doing eating. And then I have an oatmeal Bartley apple cinnamon oatmeal. I either would pack this or I would pack that um, brown sugar oatmeal. But it's in the pack. I'll pack that for her. And then she has some pasta stars and meat sauce and a side of green beans. These little meals, I get her all different flavors and everything. And she tears them up, y'all. I need to record her eating. And then I just got some more butt cream because she, her skin is very, 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 very sensitive. Very sensitive. Every once in a while, even though she don't break, even when she's not broken out already, I still put cream on her because she breaks out so easily. I mean, so easily. So I try to put some on every other day, every two days. I put some cream on her butt. Then I have just some clothes. I got two black onesies and then some black little cheetah pants. Um, she really don't mess her clothes up unless she have like an explosion. So this is only this is the only thing I pack. 
And she only goes to the babysitter when I work, so I don't need tons of clothes unless she like staying overnight. But I also have just some regular wipes. These are the premium fragrance free baby wipes from Sam's Club. Yes, I remember. Um these wipes, if you get these wipes, I love them. They put me in mind of the um, Huggy Whites, because that's what I use before this, but um, I either get the fragrance or fragrance free. It don't matter to me. I'm not picky. And then I have lots of diapers, because Delilah, she loves to drink. She loves to drink her milk. She loves to drink juice. She loves to drink water. She loves to drink, and she stay pissy. I mean, she pissed 24-7, which is a good thing, I guess. But I have diapers and these are the sam's club premium diapers just like the wipes uh, uh they got the line they got little different this one design let me find another it's like two different designs they don't have a girl box and a boy box but well, i didn't see one but these are the two different designs they feel soft they put you in mind of the pampers the pampers diapers yeah they don't have a weird smell to them. I like them. This is my first time buying them. I got these back in December. It's February and we still, oh no, we still using them. And this is how much we got all this left. So it's about time for me to go. Before this month over, go and get some more. But I have an extra pacifier. She do not like this pacifier. She will only take this pacifier if we absolutely, positively cannot find her pacifier she have now. Um, she is gonna be 14 months and she is still taking a pacifier. I can get her off. She still is drinking a bottle. Yeah, she's still drinking a bottle. Um, I only put a bottle in here in the mornings when I get ready for work. When I'm getting ready for work, I'll put a bottle in there. But, um... Yes, um, I'm gonna try to get her off the bottle sometime in March. She'll take a sippy cup, but when she, you know, gets sleepy, ready for bed, she does not want no sippy cup. She wants a bottle. So I'm gonna wing her off that bottle before I wing off that pest wire, because, baby, no, it, it, it's just not gonna happen. Delilah is a fighter. Don't, don't, don't let her fool y'all. And then I just have extra pair of socks in there. It is cold, it is February. So, yeah. That's what I keep in my baby bag. Delilah's bag. And let me see if I can find the name. Let me see if I can find the name of this bag. Um, Banana Fish Studio. I don't know if that's the brand or what, but it got unicorns. It's so pretty. Um, I had this bag for maybe four months now. And it got all dirty down here. And, you know, just been uh, fingerprints, my older kids, Lila. And it got that material in the inside to where you can just wash it. And that's what I did. I put it in the washer. Wash it. Hey, came out looking better than when I bought it brand new bag and I love it like I said I don't keep much in here because she's 14 months well, be 14, well she's 14 months since she's 14 months she don't need much um once you do go to the babysitter the babysitter I already have toys I don't have to pack toys um I do pack one bottle and then um when she do you know teeth she do have a lot of blowouts but um she already done got the two teeth in so I don't know. Whenever she start back, when some more start popping in, I'll pack some more clothes because she do have explosions. So if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. And if you want to stay for an update, well, you just keep on watching, honey. Okay, so this is an update. So I haven't posted a video 
Well, I just posted one, but before then it was like five days. Reason being is because I started a new job. That job I was telling y'all about and why did I quit I quit my CNA job video. If you haven't seen that video, click out and go watch it and come back. Anyways, I said I had an interview, so I went for the interview for that job. I want this video to be so long, so I'm trying to rush through it. If you have any, you know, questions, just comment down below. But I went for an interview. I got hired on the spot. It's a 783P position. I done already trained and everything, did orientation, all that. Um, so next week I'll be starting, you know, working by myself without a trainer. And I feel comfortable. I mean, it's the same thing at any CNA job. You just basically got to learn your residence. But so far, so good. Um, the pay was just a little bit, tad bit lower than what I, you know, been making in the CNA. So that's fine. Um, just working and handling everything has been a little overwhelming. And then trying to record and edit videos for youtube i kind of put it on the back burner but that's it y'all priority and i'm gonna start back uploading i know i said in february i was gonna um vlog every day which y'all don't get any feedback do y'all want to see the videos where i'm not really doing nothing or do you want the videos when i'm actually out and about i don't know i'm gonna just start vlogging and i can just tell do if that interests my subscribers and I want to give a shout out to one of my subscribers um they constantly commenting constantly on Instagram like uh photos and everything shout out to you you know who you are long story short I end up getting a job end up losing a babysitter end up gaining a babysitter and life's just been crazy but I'm gonna start vlogging it so y'all can see it I'm gonna start I keep going back and forth. Y'all should know me by now. But I'm going to start doing some mukbangs. My daughter want to do a mukbang. She want to do like some spicy, a spicy noodle challenge. Yeah, so I'm going to start up doing some, I'm going to upload some mukbangs and vlogs. Y'all let me know what y'all like to see, what y'all don't want to see. And yeah, and if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, still give it a thumbs up. Let me know that you watched it. Um, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. And don't forget to click the bell so you won't miss a video. And yeah, I'll see y'all on the next one.